Well, here we are again. Follow me to Apex, my friends. Reaper Hunter 23 here, welcoming you back to Let's Play Valhalla Cyberpunk Bartender Action. Alright, we left off in the middle of a break last time, and I do believe that what happened was Dana told Jill and Gil to both go out on break, and she was gonna entertain the streaming lady, or whatever. So let's see what's going on. Want one? Hmm, no thanks, I don't smoke. I don't think anyone Jill talks to smokes. Hmm. Alright, I got a text from Alma. Boss! Alma and Gil! They didn't do it! Well, that's a bummer. <laughs> oh god, alright. That'd be interesting, or that'd be. Not inter that'd be. No. She is sending congratulations your way, though. Tell her I said thanks, I guess. Yeah. So who was the lucky girl? I'm sorry, I like mushed all of that together. So it was a guy? I never thought you swung that way. It wasn't a guy. So it was a girl. I don't feel comfortable talking about that. <laughs> That's fair. You don't make things easy for me, though. How so? I mean, you're pretty hard to get close to, you know? You never talk about yourself. You're talkative, so long as it doesn't involve you directly. Teasing you is literally the only way I know how to get through to you. You make me sound like some sort of weird loner. You are a weird loner. To be fair, he is apparently... Uh, a man of mysteries. At least tell me if you enjoyed the night you spent with whoever it was. I did. Good for you. Why are you humming sun sunshine stone, stone so much though? I thought it was shine spark. Well, after that idol girl came again yesterday, I looked up her discography and I can't stop humming or listening to them. Right. Oh god. You didn't screw the idol girl, did you? But that would be... No. Kiramiki is in a relationship. No, why would that be a problem, though? I don't know, it just feel weird. Well, that's that for break. Let's go back. Right. Oh, and Gil. Hmm. Keep in mind what I said about opening up more. I mean it. That way, we won't tease you so often. Listening to you say that is the weirdest thing I've heard this year. Shut up. I wonder if Alma finds Gil attractive. What the? No, no, I, I, could, I couldn't deal with the bad juju that's associated with that song. I still don't think I've got. Alright. I wonder if New Game Plus adds a bunch of other songs to the jukebox. Back. Oh god. Hey Dorothy. What were you two doing back there? Oh, there you go. <laughs> so just chatting then. Hmm hmm hmm. Oh god, did you really? Yes, oh my god. It just, the whole time. I don't know, I don't know how they analyze this so much. You see, Gil, you're making it too obvious. How? Yeah, I don't get it either. What will you have today? I'll have a gut punch. Excuse me? Coming right. What? Nothing. Dorothy wants a gut punch. Is the world ending? Oh man, it might be. Alright, five Bronsons. One Flannergide, and because I like to watch the world burn, all of the optional Karma Drive. Oh no, I forgot to age it. <laughs> ah, no! Never mind. I 
I tried. But now we're just gonna do it here. Stop looking at me like that. Sorry. Are you okay? It's weird for you to order something like that. Yeah, I'm just trying out stuff. Did you know Willem tongs are identical? Are designed to identify food using the chemical components? Our tongues were designed with the human ones in mind. For example, the first flavors that we detect are sour and bitter, just like you guys. I checked my personal specs, and apparently my sensitivity is set to 1.2235x. Lowercase x. That makes me hate those flavors because I feel them harder. Why all that? exposition. I mean, I'd lie if I said I wasn't interested, but why? Well, after last time, I got curious and started checking how many of my systems, or how many of my systems worked in detail. For example, the tips of my fingers are so sensitive to vibrations, you could make a seismograph with them. Oh, wow, that's cool. Huh. And checking that, I found it's all based on how humans work. That got me thinking about what you said. I mean, for my systems to work, humans need to under had to understand how they work. And after all those discoveries, they're not any more or less artificial. Why should I be? I don't know. Looking up all of that stuff suddenly made me feel real. Well, that's good. Did you get invited to the party? Yeah, she did. I remember. It was like the opposite of what I felt last time. I feel like I'm here right now. Glad to hear that. Alright, then let's try something sweet now. Something sweet. That's more like it. I should probably go to super flavor. Uh, well, she likes Piano Woman's, so... To be honest, it's a bit surreal for me. What? I'm here talking to you and you're answering like any human would. You're even expressing happiness. I remember when I was a kid, I usually tried to strike conversation with AIs. AI. But after a bit, they just start looping through their built-in answers, repeating the same things over and over. That always made me crash back into reality. When I think back to that, having such advanced AIs like you right now, it's amazing. Sometimes I like to make the uh, Cortana on the computer tell me jokes. I don't know, it makes my inner child happy to see something she's always dreamt of. It helps when I feel particularly cynical. Oh, you flatter me. <laughs> Besides, I've thought about humans. I've always thought about humans like nature's lilum. The method might have been different, but we too evolved from a more simple form ages ago. If Willem managed to create biological life, years from now it will have all come full circle. So what should I take from this is, or what I should take from this is, you love me. <laughs> Don't overdo it. Anything else? Let's go with a sugar rush. Alright. One, two, one. Ta da! Here. Even in doubt, my love for these is real. How romantic. So I take the whole silip. whatever, got solved. Yep. All the reality crises started the other day. My guardian. Call her mom, no one's judging you. Mom decided to meet with the mother of her daughter's girlfriend. Okay. It was a very emotional meeting. They both said they felt like they closed a long chapter. I was moved, but that's when it set in. Why was I moved? I never met any of them, so where did these feelings come from? Why do I feel these things? Do I really feel them? 
What tells me someone isn't pressing a button to make me feel that? What tells me I'm in my body? What is real? Boom. <laughs> oh, don't worry, by the way, I'm fine. <clears throat> Thank god it's unnatural to see you down like that. Man, that go-go is a blast. What does that mean? Don't you feel like talking a bit more with Diddy? A very weird noise just came from behind me. Besides, I want to talk with the bartenders. Oh, no. Well, I tried, Jill. I'll be in my office. And she just cut right into... No! No! I was listening to... Cute little girl, Willem. Cam girl. Oh, fiddlesticks. What's your name, girl? I'm Dorothy Hayes at your service. Do you come here often? Are you hitting on me? Hey Dorothy, I'm in the middle of a live stream. Do you want to participate? Sure, sounds fun. This is- nothing good can come from this. This must be stopped. Okay, let's take a recommendation from you. What should I drink next? Try the sugar rush. Bartender, a sugar rush over here. Bar. Ten. Der. Sorry, what? Sugar rush, please. Right. Can, can I have my jukebox back? Sugar Rush again. Ta-da. Here. Good choice, Dorothy. Yay. So what are you doing in my turf? Um, streaming, John? Yes. No, I mean that's what she calls herself. Man, that's a tacky name. No kidding. Yeah, but it's my tacky name. Okay, good. They let my music come back. Actually, it's not really my name. What's your real name, then? Nicole Chen. Alright. Humble. Why not call yourself Streaming Chen? That is... that would be better. That would be clever. And I like that way more. It's funny that you mention it. You see, when I started, I called myself Nico Nico Chen. I changed websites, so the name felt a bit out of place, thus I became Streaming Chen. Everyone nicknamed me Streaming Chan, though, so I just went along with it. Oh yeah, I get it. At one point I was gonna call myself Dolores Hayes. Well, yeah, that's how that name is actually originated. But then I realized the name was as subtle as a brick to the face. Anyway, I'm here because last time I came I ended up with a great, greater viewer numbers than usual. And so I wanted to treat my loyal audience again. Ooh, I see. Well, you came to the right place, especially if you're looking for some comfy fun. Honey here might seem harsh, but you just need to crack her shell. Shut up. See, you just need to say the right thing at the right time and she becomes a sweetheart. <laughs> Quiet, you. Don't play hard to get, you know it's true. <laughs> hey, stream girl. That's me. I regret asking this, but don't you have a sponsor? It's weird it's been this long without some advertisement. I have, but you see. The contract with them expired, so Marvin. The business guy or whatever had to make a new one. He was gonna send the draft to his lawyer, and as as it had a couple of additions, but um, let's say he got too excited with my oh no, gross. God 
Dang it, Marvin. Why, yeah, why the contract? Alright, this conversation is getting out of hand. Some people, seriously. <laughs> Ouch. What? <laughs> people have actually done that? <laughs> that said, Gil's been grimacing for a full minute now. Don't mind me. Huh. But you know, I like you, Dorothy. Why don't we celebrate with beers? My treat. Alright. Two big beers. Alright. Well, that conversation was weird. I just went dead. I went silent because, yeah. That was strange. Oh, I need to double all of this. Darn it. One down. One, two, one, two, three, four. I wish that the writing wouldn't just nosedive into the weird, like. You see, it does that stuff, and it does that stuff like every once in a while, but then everything else is like really good. Like Alma's conversations with Jill, most of the time, I really enjoy. But that one was the most egregious and over the top it has been so far. Cheers. Cheers. Alright, I'm not feeling my tongue or my feet. Time to get- oh, great. Now she's drunk. Did I hear lewd? Do you have any stories? Great. This is what I get for loading up the one with Carmel Trine. Whatever. Uh, in a jacuzzi. And you recorded it. How would you even... That doesn't make... Because you can't... Waterproof cameras in the future aren't that far-fetched, I guess. Keep in mind the heat. Heat isn't good with cameras, no. <laughs> More convoluted. Small cooler. I opened a hole for the lens. <laughs> Did it need any weight? Yep, luckily the guy was into bodybuilding, so we used some old dumbbells. He was also ripped, but that's another story. Oh. Uh. Felt like she was dying. What? Well, you're also a robot? So... Well, it's so situational and expensive. Yeah. Besides, those cooling systems require too much maintenance. Wait, I think I should leave. Care to join me in escapades for the rest of the night? Can I plug my services at the end of the night? Ugh, go figure. Sure. Then count me in, I've got the perfect stories. Oh no, we have set upon the world a great and terrible duo. Goodbye, bartender. 
Well, let's start with the story. <laughs> there was this Mega Santa. Wait, seriously? They left. Right. Yeah, <laughs> you're telling me. At least they look like they're having fun. That method of filming underwater sound sounded convoluted, though. Yeah. We're done, boss. Man, don't you just feel great? We're in the same place. Were we in the same place? Here, Jill. What's this? A bonus. Today I got a taste of the kind of clients you deal with, and... Keep it up. <laughs> yeah. Well, tomorrow is the big day, so get ready. That goes for both of you. Either I'm getting old, or that girl was too much, even for me. Alright. Nice. You have no notifications or reminders? <clears throat> I'll leave the closet open in case you want to hide from the noise. Thanks. Alright, I guess we'll save it then. We don't need to stay on the day 16 file anymore since we did, in fact, make rent. So happy. Down for maintenance. What about dangerous opinions? Thank you. Oh. Wait, what? The road was rocky, things weren't as smooth as we had hoped. Around the end of development, we even had some people act with each other, but just like Big Match John, we beat the odds and s kicked out at two. <laughs> God dang it. References to The Rock, left and right, The Iron Sheik, now John Cena. Do -do -do -do. Choose from now? Whoa. That looks cool. I don't know what that is, though. Table. Whatever. Weird message. Anyway. It's time for another party. Which is cool, because the little Christmas party was great. Saturday, December 31st.